This How to Do Florida segment is presented by Visit Florida. Canaveral National Seashore, 58,000 acres of pure Florida. Isolated, unspoiled, teeming with wildlife, history, and plenty of family fun. There are a lot of ways to enjoy this beautiful national park. Three beaches span the 24 miles of beautiful shoreline. It's the longest stretch of undeveloped public beach on Florida's east coast. Thanks to the sheer size, you can look forward to truly tranquil days. Once you cross over the landmark dunes, you're in your own piece of paradise. Enjoy surf fishing, paddle boarding, or just lay back and take it in. Then, there are the trails. As a barrier island sanctuary for threatened wildlife, it's home to 14 threatened and endangered animal species, including five species of sea turtles, the West Indian manatee, and the all-American bald eagle. And be sure to include at least one of the three preserved historical sites on your hike. Turtle Mound, Seminole Rest, and the Eldora State House. The Eldora State House has been beautifully preserved and offers a window into 19th century Florida life. And last, but not certainly least, there's the Mosquito Lagoon. Bring a boat and launch into some of the best red fishing in the world. Isn't that gorgeous? You might even hook a spotted sea trout or a variety of other species found in the beautiful backcountry or shallow water estuary of the Mosquito Lagoon. As a migratory corridor and diverse habitat, Canaveral National Seashore is home to dozens of species. Or commit to the entire experience with a good old-fashioned campout. Canaveral National Seashore has designated campsites on many of the islands within the sanctuary. Don't miss this truly wild Florida experience. This How to Do Florida segment was presented by Visit Florida.